All right, I'll shoot a quick video here. So to open up DCS, open beta in the multi-threading function or mode, whatever, file explorer, figure out where your DCS is loaded. I have one drive for just that, or you can click this PC and then whatever it might be in these guys here. Uh, click on that DCS world. And then you come down and find this folder, bin-mt, which is the new multi-threader bin. Click it, and then you get this executable right here. You double-click that, it'll open up DCS in the multi-threading mode. What I did is I actually copied and made me an icon right here, so it's easier to navigate to. But both work the same. Double-click that. And then we wait. Gotta delete that soon. Make it go away. Or just buy the thing and make it go away. Okay, so it opens up and looks exactly like DCS Open Beta. Let's check multiplayer. Quite a few are on here. I wonder if uh, I wonder if they're not all loading in on my favorites list because they haven't been updated yet, or if there's some kind of a weird deal where you have to allow like the multi-threading deal. Not sure, but our server's on there. Enigmas, Buddy Spike, Larpy, Tempest, Wolfpack, Four Way, some DOK ones. Um, let's do this real quick. Let's get out of there. Let's go to just regular open beta without the multi-thread. I guess what I should have done is when I was in there on the multi-thread is open up a uh, task manager and see what my CPU cores are doing. See if one of them's melting and my other 23 are just like sitting there. Multiplayer. So far, the list seems the same to me. <laughs> That's it. It's easy as that. Click this folder thing. Click your DCS thing. DCS world. Bin MT. That guy that looks like an icon. Off you go. Try it out. See what you think. I'm going to test it later and, and see if I can notice a difference or anything in performance or on my monitors and whatnot. We'll see. So, peace out.